Warm Springs Middle School, and welcome back to Wolfpack News. I'm Levi Hot, and today is Wednesday. Hi, Hi Warm Springs Middle School. This is Nikki Coles from the Morgan County Partnership. And now it's time for a PSA for the day. What I do now and who I am now, my name is John M. Sweeney. I'm the founder and chief kindness officer of a global social movement called Suspend the Coffees which has positively impacted the lives of millions of people. So some of my slides, which I was going to go really quickly through because I have something else that I want to say at the end. I don't really fully know what to expect of these. But um, so my idea, and my friend's idea who helped me make the slides, is to beat bullying with kindness. So bullying, for those of you who maybe don't know the actual term, is repeated, persistent, and aggressive behavior intended to cause fear, distress, or harm to another person's body, emotion, self-esteem, or reputation. Being bullied stays with you forever. It stayed with me forever. There isn't a day goes by where I don't think about what happened. So Lady Gaga has a quote there, which I think being bullied is far worse than being hit by someone. The power of words is far more reaching and has uncalculated risk involved. So I've always been terrified about wh what people say about me, about what they think, about what they tell people. But not anymore. But it still carries with me like a massive weight on my shoulders. All my life I've carried it. So I always say to people, you really need to be careful with your words because you just never know what impact they're going to have. Being bullied really does stay with you forever. 13-year-old Morgan Mewson, I can't pronounce it, sorry. Uh, bullied because she was six feet tall, overdosed on painkillers. 14-year-old Hannah Smith, taunted online, hung herself in her bedroom. 15-year-old Natasha McBride received an abusive message on social media and threw herself under a train. These are people. And some of us are doing this. Some of us are causing this to happen. So there's bullying everywhere. In education, relationships, politics, the workplace, social groups, friendships. Sometimes bullies are disguised as family. Sometimes friends pretend to be your friends, but they're not. They just use you. 52-year-old Kevin Morrissey, persistently bullied by his boss, shot himself. These are people. Zac Efron. I got made fun of constantly in high school. That's what built my character. That's what makes you who you are. When you get made fun of, when people point out your weaknesses, that's just another opportunity for you to rise above it. So you can rise above it. And for me, the time I rose above it was when I believed in myself and when I stopped worrying about everyone else. And I said, you know what? Sodom, I'm going to be who I am. And I don't care anymore. Well, actually, I do care. But I'm not going to let it dictate my life. I'm going to be who I want to be. Demi Lovato. People say sticks and stones may break your bones, but names can never hurt you. But that's not true. Words can hurt you. They hurt me. Things were said to me that I still haven't forgotten. Zane, I can't pronounce, anyone know his second name? Okay, Zane, what she said. No matter how many people try to criticize you, the best revenge is to prove them wrong. So Graham Moore, stay weird, stay different, is a quote that he says. He said, when I was 16, year old, 16 years old, I tried to kill myself because I felt weird, I felt different, I felt like I did not belong, and now I'm standing here, and so I would like for this moment to be for that kid out there who feels like she's weird or she's different or she doesn't fit in anywhere. Yes, you do. I promise you, you do. Stay weird, stay different. Like, we should celebrate our quirkiness. Never let a single soul tell you who you can't, you can't be exactly who you are. Bullies aren't born, they're raised. So there's a reason why people bully. Quite often, it's because they're being bullied themselves or something's wrong. Something's wrong somewhere. Bullies aren't born, they're raised. So it could be a strained home life, poor academic performance, isolation, abuse, victims, victims of bullying themselves. Beat bullying with kindness. Kindness, the quality of being friendly, generous, and considerate. And there's loads of other things, cinnamons, whatever that means. I didn't stay in school that long. <laughs> Beat bullying with kindness. 
So Ellen DeGeneres, DeGeneres, as I like to call her, is a massive hero of mine, and I'm going to have coffee with her someday. I guarantee you that. So she got an award recently, uh, which said it's a little strange to actually get an award for being nice and generous and kind, which is what we're all supposed to do to one another. That's the point of being human. Kindness is something that we should all have. That's an innate quality that we all have, and we all need more of that out there. That was great. Thank you for watching Wolfpack News. In the meantime, if you have a story to share with us, you can email wolfpacknewschannel at gmail.com.